Hi, I'm Nicholas Hasem, the Secretary General's Special Representative and Head of the United Nations Mission in South Sudan. Every year on October the 24th, we mark United Nations Day to commemorate the historic occasion when the organization was founded in 1945 in the wake of World War II. UN Day gives us an opportunity to renew our commitment to global peace and security, especially in the current climate of global economic, political and social crisis. South Sudan became a member of the UN 11 years ago when the nation won its independence. Today, across this young nation, millions of people continue to suffer from conflict, which is compounded by the worst flooding in nearly a century and extreme food insecurity. To help tackle these challenges and bring relief to the people, the UN family is working in partnership with the government and the people of South Sudan to uphold the principle of humanity, security, gender equality, protection of civilians and sustainable development. While the primary responsibility for the protection of civilians lies with the government, UNMIS is doing all we can to prevent violence, to build trust and restore security. Our peacekeepers are responding rapidly to conflict hotspots, including by establishing temporary operating bases and by increasing our integrated patrols. UN humanitarian agencies are providing life-saving support in many areas in the face of dwindling resources and, at times, under serious threat to their own lives. We're also supporting an inclusive constitution-making process. The aim is to forge a social contract among all South Sudanese so that they can live together in peace, unity and harmony. We could not carry out our work without the support of the communities we serve, the South Sudanese people. We reassure you today that the UN stands shoulder to shoulder with you as you navigate the difficult but meaningful journey from war to lasting peace. On this UN Day, I call on all the South Sudanese people, especially their leaders, to put aside their differences and work together to achieve peace, security and prosperity for all. It is through national unity and strength of political purpose that remaining benchmarks contained within the revitalized peace agreement can be achieved. Free, fair and credible elections can be held on time and the people of this rich and vibrant land can enjoy the prosperous and secure future they richly deserve. Happy UN Day.